Hi, and welcome to another episode of Graceful Ceramics. Today we will be learning how to pour our own plaster. So to start off, we can fill a 50 gallon bucket with water, or about halfway. We need to make sure the water is nice and warm because we will need that so that it interacts with the plaster that we will put in it soon. Look at that water. Remember, pottery plaster comes in a powdered form and should not be breathed in. Always wear a mask and be in a properly ventilated area as it can cause severe burns and lung issues when breathed in. When you've got the water bucket filled and ready, pour your plaster into the bucket. Make sure that the bucket is in a secure position and always, and have a scale on it under the bucket just to make sure that you get the pro proper ratio of 50 water, ratio of 50 water 50 plaster remember the plaster is in a powdered form and can cause severe damage to your lungs if breathed breathed in always pour your plaster in a well ventilated area and have a vent or a mask on As you can see, the plaster and water mixture is starting to bubble. This is the plaster and water mixing and forming a chemical reaction, and that is causing heat to be expelled by the. And is causing heat to be expelled even at an even greater amount than when the water was at before. Thoroughly mix both the plaster and water together using your hands or a stirring utensil. It is best to use your hands as this as in this way you can feel the plaster as it thickens up to the proper consi consistency that you need it to be at. Using the four uh, clay molds that we set up last episode, place four boxes around them with clay to cover up the gaps. And then pour the plaster that we have just made into each mold, mold to just above the clay molds that we made. In case of a blowout, use clay to cover up any holes. 
quickly now. There we go. Uh, 